It's Sunday, it's nearly three weeks until the concert and it's an incredibly rainy day. It's completely thundery and horrible outside. So it feels like quite a good moody day for practicing Ratmalinoff, I'm quite enjoying it. So today I'm consolidating a lot of the work I did yesterday. I recorded myself playing the whole concerto and I took notes on things that I wanted to improve or just do differently. So I worked through that whole list, in fact. This is my list. The, that was all my comments from the first movement. This is the second movement. And this is the third movement. So quite a lot of stuff that I wanted to work on. And today I'm just gonna try and bring all that together. also working on the very opening. Um, the opening is not as technically challenging as the rest of the concerto, but I felt that last time I performed this concerto that as a result maybe I hadn't practiced it as much and it just felt a tiny bit shaky. So I have been really prioritizing that and every single day working on that opening passage, um, sometimes slowly, but just really relaxed, really comfortable, so that when I walk on, I know that I'm a thousand percent confident. The Rachmaninoff is basically ready. I usually do aim to have a piece ready about a month before the concert, just so I have time to, you know, enjoy getting comfortable and just playing around with it, exploring. Um, but this time, it's actually been completely crucial because I can't really work on it anymore. In the immediate future, because I've got a solo recital um, coming up on Saturday, so I need to now focus on that and really get myself into the mindset for all that solo music. And then I have a duo recital with my duo partner. So we're going to be rehearsing for that. And so I'm not really going to have that much time now to practice the Rachmaninoff until the week of the concert itself. It's 
Tuesday. Uh, the concert is in four days on Saturday. And I had a little break from the Rachmaninoff. I came back to it on Sunday after the last concert and um, it's feeling quite good actually. It's had a good settling period. All the technical work that I've done is really starting to pay off now. My task for this week is just to get really kind of comfortable and free. I'm making some tea because I'm just about to record myself playing the whole thing through. And then I'm going to listen back. I can't believe that I'm still <laughs> practicing on the upright. Um, we still haven't managed to do our building works and get the grand piano in, so never mind. Hi again, we're back here. It's the day before the concert. My priority today is just to relax and get into the right mindset for performing tomorrow. So I'm going to go for a walk, I might have a nap, um, I'll probably do some yoga. And then in terms of practice, I'm just gonna be focusing on really relaxed, generally slow practice. Um, I've done quite a lot yesterday with my eyes shut, the whole concerto, slightly under speed with my eyes shut. And today I'm going to be concentrating on that feeling of weight flowing through my arms, through my fingers, through the keys and into the floor so that I feel really um, grounded in the piece, really secure and relaxed. And then tomorrow I can just let rip. <laughs> 